Hi guys, Todd here. Blog time. Uh, am I too close or too far away? Uh, right, what's been happening? I uh, just uploaded a review for the Titanium Bagua uh, 22. Good mod. It's a very good mod. Uh, just... Oh, shut up. It just... Uh, it's just good. It's not brilliant or exceptional or it just... I don't think it would ever let you down. I don't think you'd ever be disappointed with it, but it just didn't seem to do it for me. As I said in the video, I'm, I'm just becoming a f fussy old bastard. Uh, <laughs> what else have I got coming up? Uh, what else did I do this week? Uh, I'm sure I did a few reviews this week. Did I? I did. The Amiga. Cracking little bit of kit. Um, it's just one of these cloud chaser things, you know. You can get to vape like a, a normal type atty, but uh, if you're a cloud chaser, wah, you'll love it. Uh, everything else that's coming along, you know about. Uh, the only thing that I've added to the list is the Black Sioux Mod Kit limited edition version by Chief Vapors Pat. So that's the Sue mod and the Immortalizer black and brass. I've been looking at it in Schmo Vapes and thinking it's limited edition, I don't really need to review it, you know there's only so many left. But then curiosity just got the better of me and I ordered it. Here's me not working either. Uh, uh, so I've sold off some other stuff to pay for it. Uh, what else? Oh, the, the drip tips. Uh, by Zaris. I've got to dish them out to folk. Um, Christ almighty, what else did I do? Losing it here. I really am. Uh, got the drip tips. Told you about the Mega. The Skynet. The Squonker. Love it. Used it a lot. Uh, but then squonking. I love squonking. Uh, keep saying it. If you've not tried it, give it a bash. Um, <coughs> expensive piece of kit. Really is. Um, you know, when you combine the cost with the Privari. But when you look at what you're going to pay for a top of the range squonking kit anyway. Mm. And the other one. K Fun Light Plus. I think it's today or tomorrow, it's tomorrow, Saturday, gets released, uh, Cloud9 vaping, and what can you say? What can I say? Where is it? Oh, it's in the house. <laughs> Everything's in the house. Um, it's a... I've got to beat around the bush here. It's a K-Fun. You know, it vapes like a K-Fun. Uh, the only difference being is that the, the deck, you know, the, the bottom section is different. It's got another hole drilled in it with some airflow control um, and a, an o-ring on the screw um, I've got to say if you like the vape on the k Light, light then I wouldn't sell it I'd stick with it uh, and I wouldn't upgrade to the Light Plus the only way I would upgrade to the Light Plus is if I had an issue with the airflow and if it was too airy for me then I'd go for the Light Plus um, that's really it on that one. Uh, what else? I did the Joytech E roll, which I've given away. Really like that. Really like that. Uh, I'm very surprised by it uh, and the quality of the vape. You know, uh, very surprised. Uh, I'm actually looking for something to vape here. Oh, I'll do. What that is, that's uh, that's an Atmum Huxhah, Atmum Huxhani, uh, little dripper. 
and uh, that's a switch drip tip in the top on just a bog standard EVOD. I've actually got a, uh, a cotton build in here. I might do a little review, a little tutorial in that, uh, just to show how the cotton build works in there. But it's astounding. Uh, rather than having the wick coming up inside, I've got wrapped around the, the cup, the ceramic cup, I've got cotton just wrapped and wrapped and wrapped around it and it holds a hell of a juice uh, but it vapes huh. <sighs> bra uh, bra um, uh, what else big shout out to Tim uh, Trip Hammer you funky dude you uh, <laughs> sent me on some of his Victoria sponge e-liquid gems and Martinique I think it's called just it's a sweetie fest it's like it's like breaking into the tuck shop and just stuffing your face um, it, just all these e-liquids are just sweeties I mean they're fantastic uh, I had a little bit of shuffle in the shed, cleaned things up a little bit, tidied up. Uh, so I've got all my batteries up there, my clearamizers and whatnot go up here as well. Uh, and my Aegis, and, and that's all the Aegis I've got, is Trip Hammer, uh, Mrs. Lord, Goose Juice, Vaping King, and Cospa's Juice. And I've got some uh, Bumblebee that I'm still trying out. Uh, so that's my e liquid collection. Um, that's really it, guys. That's really it. Uh, rants and raves. <laughs> uh, none. None whatsoever. None whatsoever. Um, the whole nah, I go for it. What the hell? Uh, the whole clone thing. Just I mean, it's seen in Facebook now. You know, there's there's groups set up called Clones Only and whatnot, and, and it just that grinds me. That really grinds me. Uh, I mean, I know there's so many different viewpoints you can have in this whole clone thing. I mean, I'm not entirely daft. I mean, I can see some people's point of view on it. Uh, but, you know, when you see people that are bragging about the fact that they have 30 clones, uh, you know, they could have bought the real thing. If they can afford 30 clones, then they can afford to buy the real thing. That's, I just look at, I mean, I, my point of view, is just put yourself in the position that you had a shed and a lathe and you were building mods just you, nobody else and you were hand turning them and you were making them by hand uh, and you were, you were selling them you're not going to make them in any great, any great quantity because you can't, you're not seeing, seeing them or anything like that uh, and then the next thing you see they're on fast tech and they're being sold for a tenner. How mad would that make you? I mean, that that's always my look. That's how I look at it. That's my viewpoint. Um, and I feel for the guys that, you know, put their heart and soul into these things and are getting ripped off. But that's just me. Anyway, enough babbling and crap. Um, If you are in, if you're having trouble understanding what I am saying sometimes, and I'm speaking in a very clear and uh, this is my telephone voice, uh, go on YouTube and look for a program called Still Game. Uh, all the episodes are on there. This should help you understand me a lot better. Uh, and if you can't understand me after watching that, Get it up, yeah. <laughs>
watch the programme, you'll get that. Uh, anyway, I better go. Uh, it's late Friday afternoon, I've got stuff to do and I've got a weekend of chilling out. So, all the best guys.